Welcome back. We are here at eToro looking at the WTI uh, oil contracts. And as you can see, both uh, Monday session and Tuesday session were quite bullish. And at the moment, I believe that we'll go uh, and test these highs. Um, if we were to, uh, to uh, go uh, beyond these highs here, we have the 200 moving average. And I do believe this is going to be significant resistant. Um, in the long term, of course, we may go higher than this. If we were to do that, we'll go and test 90, uh, 49 and 50 uh, levels. Uh, however, in the short run, I believe that 200 moving average will be significant resistance. Furthermore, we have the Fibonacci retracement levels, and we can see that we're just about to hit the 61.8 uh, Fibonacci retracement. Uh, which also be significant resistant. On the lower side, we have the 15 moving average, and this will be support as well. Um, the oil markets uh, like to um, trade in ranges, and uh, at the moment, I believe that we are looking at the 10 to uh, 15 dollar range, um, being around. Thirty-one dollars to the the highs, and uh, around around uh, around thirty-six dollars to the lows. So as you can see, uh, in the last few weeks, we have been trading in this um, is in this um, these lows and these highs, and I believe that we will continue until we see this uh, 50 moving average go getting a little bit higher and this uh, 200 moving average getting a little bit lower. At some point they will cross and we'll have um, uh, quite a significant movement um, to the upside. Um, however, cases for the coronavirus cases, they are increasing around the world. And of course, this is affecting uh, travel and this is affecting uh, yeah, air travel and, uh, and also um, cruise liners and so on. So demand isn't there. So we may see uh, OPEC and other countries uh, reduce their, uh, their production and that may increase the price. However, we are not even near the same uh, production level uh, as we were prior to the coronavirus. So just have that in mind. It, uh, a massive move to the upside uh, is taking a selling opportunity. So if we look at the other indicators, we can see that the RSI is not overbought, it's not oversold. Uh, we may see some upwards uh, momentum still. Um, and the same goes for the MACD. We see that uh, now the stochastic uh, momentum is upwards, and um, the MACD at the moment, uh, we may see this line cross, and that will indicate that we will go higher. However, the Fibonacci retracement and the 200 moving average will uh, be significant resistant, and the 50 moving average, and also these, um, the, uh, this. Um, the uh, 36 level will also be uh, significant support. Um, happy trading. Hope you find this video helpful and uh, good luck.